Good morning, Blue Devils. Today is Wednesday, September 29th. Welcome back to the School News. We are your hosts, Reese. And Will. And this is your news. First COVID cases are nearing an all-time high and wearing a mask is required in all Fayette County public school buildings. Everyone is being asked to wear one to protect lives. Hey y'all, today will be the first date of our first student blood drive. If you are 17 or older, you will be eligible, eligible to give the gift of life. NFCPS has opened a testing site at the Old Herald Leader building on the corner of Man to Midland, open seven days a week from 2 to 6 p.m. Don't leave it to chance if you've been exposed to someone with COVID, get tested ASAP. The Gary R. Martin College Fair is happening next week on Monday, October 4th from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Rupp Arena. Multiple colleges will be setting up stands for students to learn about the different colleges that are offered. Admission is free and is a great opportunity for Henry Henry Clay student. Juniors interested in applying for the Governor's Scholar Program need to attend an info session. Choose one meeting October 4th, 5th, or 6th during advisory or Tuesday, October 5th at 8 p.m. or a.m. All meetings will be in the Henry Clay Library. More info on the counseling webpage. Did you know that we offer a free food backpack program? It is a bag full of food items such as noodles, chips, granola bars, etc. For any student needing additional food, pick up days or Thursdays in Miss Bowman's room, 129A. You can just grab one and go. And now on to club meetings. This Friday, October 1st from 3.15 p.m. to 4 on room 24, there will be the first French club meeting of the year. There will be food, introduction, games, French stuff, and more. All are welcome to come and enjoy. The first Cultural Diversity International Club meeting will be this Wednesday, September 29th in room 28, Miss Lyons' room, right after school. Looking for a new scene? Try tea, as in the drink, and the people who drink it. Tea will be provided, and you are always welcome to bring your own. They will meet every Tuesday, not so much Monday, but now Tuesdays after school in room 159. Tuesdays like today. See you there. Now to sports. The bowling team needs you. Yes, you. Come out for practice on October 24th and see if you have what it takes. If you, are, if you have any other questions, see Coach Smith in room 105. The girls soccer team is celebrating their seniors on Wednesday night against Bryan Station at 6 p.m. Admission is free with a student ID. Please come out and show these seniors some love. The JV football team beat Western Hills on Monday night, 38-8. to We will be back in action next Monday at Scott County at 5.30. And speaking on football. The varsity team is back in action this Friday after a two-week hiatus. They will be at Bryan Station taking on the Defenders. Kickoff is at 7.30 p.m. And we will love to have the whole student body out there supporting them. Go Devils. Boys soccer was in action over the weekend, losing to St. Louis University Prep and beating Warren Central. They were celebrating their senior night tonight at 6.15 p.m. at Henry Clay against West Jessman. Admission is free for students with their ID badge. Come out and cheer on these seniors in their final regular season game. Esports will meet in room 102 Yellow Hallway upstairs at 3.30 p.m. on Thursdays. Games played will be Smite, League of Legends, Super Smash Bros, Splatoon, FIFA, Madden, and Rocket League. We, we welcome all of you to come and participate. This has been your news for today. I'm Reese. And I'm Will. Reminding you to never be blue and don't be the devil. But